Um, today, Sarah's Tasty Treats got a package in the mail from Delicious. So I saw this company online, and um, they make um, like a chicken product, but it's not it's not real chicken. It's like soy, like um, little like granules, or I don't know what you really call it. And you mix it with some water and maybe some oil, and it forms into like a chicken strip. And it also came with a couple of um, spices. So I'm going to open this and show you exactly what it is. So this is a package once I opened it. I, they package these upside down. These are the um, spices. So I can already smell them. They're very fragrant. This one's a nacho cheese. Um, seasoning. So, I guess for those who are going to ask, it is vegan. Um, vegetable powder, onion, uh, what does it say? Garlic, tomato, chickpea flour, yeast. Natural pink, Himalayan, sea salt, herbs, spices, and natural flavors. So that's the first one. Second one I got is a Chipotle one, which is also vegan, plant-based. <laughs> These are the ingredients. And then it also came also came with the delicious plant-based chicken clean and lean plant mix. Just add water and oil. And it's 20 grams of protein per serving. Used in any way chicken recipe. No soy. And then it tells you delicious plant-based chicken. No added salt or preservatives. Tastes and feels like, cooks like real chicken. Um, 20 grams of plant protein per serving. Those are the directions. And it sounds delicious. So it says to add oil, but I don't really cook with oil. Um, I'm going to try it with um, vegetable, no, uh, yeah, vegetable stock and see if that works. And if not, not, I don't mind using just a little bit of oil just to try it out but i'll make some for dinner tonight i will show you how it works and if it tastes good and give my final review again this is not sponsored i just saw this on facebook and wanted to try it oh it's made in australia so again it's delicious plant-based chicken lean clean and lean plant mix So this package I learned about from, if you follow Tabitha Brown, she's a uh, vegan, like, influencer and whatnot, and she makes recipes and stuff, and she does reviews on Fridays, um, and she did a snack review, and I got these nuts, they're called Karma, Karma Nuts. And they were free. It's not a scam. So you just pay for like $3 shipping. So I bought this delicious um, plant-based chicken. Um, I bought it on my own. This is not sponsored. Um, this is going to go into the unboxing video I did with um, a bunch of other things I had bought. Um, anyways, 
So I saw it on Facebook, thought I'd try it out. So I'm making pasta today. So I made like, I already made like a um, fresh tofu pasta. So instead of using egg, I used tofu. Um, so I already made that and I thought, why not add some meatless balls? So it says you can make them into meatless balls. So you just add the water and the oil, but in my case, I'm using vegetable stock or vegetable broth, whatever, because I'm going oil free. Um, so you just want to add the contents to a bowl, stir, and then shape into anything you want. And it says to cook it in oil or fry it or heat it till it's golden brown. But I'm going to cook mine in my mushroom sauce that's simmering on the stove. Um, also, I thought this um, would be good in the meatballs. So I'm going to add a little bit of this nacho cheese. Delicious. This is also plant-based, vegan. And um, I have all the information about these in my unboxing video don't mind my dirty cutting board that's from mushrooms um so anyways i'm gonna get get this started and yeah i think i'm gonna add some sauce on top so i can cover the meatballs so i'm gonna do that and i will see you soon meatballs. all right so this is the plant-based meatballs uh meatless chicken balls and my boyfriend Peter is gonna try it and give his opinion. All right, it's gonna be a little hot. It's supposed to mimic chicken, does it? It does. I put a little bit of cheesy um, seasoning in it. It actually tastes a bit more meaty. It tastes meaty? A little more meaty, but you know what? Hey, as long as it's not actual meat. Yeah, it's plant-based. I'm trying to go somewhat meatless. Let me try it. Is it going cook long enough? Are they supposed to be hot or soft? Well, like meatballs. They're a little soft, but you know what? They're very hot in the center. Yeah, I think they're good. I think it's a good flavor. And the texture reminds me of chicken. Doesn't it remind you of chicken? It does. This would be good. I was like chicken, like um, like taco, chicken tacos, or Probably. like something like that. Um, chicken pot pie. Yes, some good substitute for your typical chicken pot pie. Yep. So that's our review, and I will put in the description box down below how you can purchase this. Um, yeah, I thought it was pretty good. So, um, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and follow me on all my social medias.